um, the surround action. I am not at all trying to uh, minimize the incredible challenge and complexity and hard work we're all doing, both in DEI and in L&D. There is a lot we take on. And I don't want anyone out of this to, to feel like I don't acknowledge or value or recognize that. And at the same time, I am so passionate about this area. I have to ask, is it enough? And we're all asking this question in one way or the other. This is where we really start to move from training that event-based, maybe safe space or listening session. And even our strategic sessions, our leaders are often um, engaged in. And we really start to say, how do we grow people's capability, not just in the moment, but in all the different moments they are most likely to run into DEI needs. And so we might ask, what problems are the various personas we came up with um, most likely to encounter? So if I think about capacity overloaded person, right, they might be in a meeting and accidentally say something just because they didn't have the capacity. That's a problem they might encounter. How might I um, support someone who might have made that faux pas in that moment as an L&D person trying to build organizational capability? What will they use when they run into a problem? Who or what do these personas turn to first or most often when they have a need? We want to build on that and help make sure that those avenues are quality because, yes, we have a lot of choices today, but we have a lot of choices today. And you don't want your empl employees having to hunt through all those choices all the time. And L&D can play a really big role in um, making sure that there's quality experiences out there. And what assets are needed to achieve the specific on-the-job behaviors we outlined at the beginning? So we usually coach organizations for a particular learning um, cluster to have about five to 10 assets. No more than that because it gets quite a bit um, tough to manage at that point. Um, but this five to 10, you can really go beyond the moment and surround your learners with a meaningful strategic set, especially having done the learner persona work and the change work.